Image to STL by Blood Light. Generate 3D STL files from a range of image formats. Appropriately shaded images create content for 3D print or CNC carving applications. The software presents as shown. Default parameters reduce output for 3D printing. Controls are easily adjusted to create litho fanes, molds or gas relief surfaces. An open image button loads source images. Target size values establish XY output dimensions. A lock ratio option allows fixed or free image aspect ratio. Target height specifies output mesh Z height. Non-zero at base values include a base element of specified thickness in the output. Max red value sets the edge dimension of the smallest faces in the mesh. Spike and anti-spike filters smooth or flatten discrepancies reduced by isolated pixels. Compute alpha channel includes transparent areas of the source image in the output mesh. Invert output inverts color values to change mesh displacement direction. The enable black-white threshold option and slider allow control reduction of shading to produce a monochrome silhouette. The ASTL initiates save of generated output. Image to STL works a little differently than most utilities of this type. Default setup generates surfaces for additive methods. Black equals high, white equals low. Shop settings for subtractive or cutting output are easily established. Once settings are in place, many images can quickly be processed to STL surface at user-defined resolution. In this case, Target size is set at 150 by 150 millimeters. Target height is set at 8 millimeters. Add base value of 0 millimeters removes the default base element. Max res sets the minimum size of the smallest faces. This setting impacts level of detail captured from the image. Max res value will vary with output size and source image. Division and target size by the number of image pixels gives single pixel dimensions. In this case, 150 millimeters divided by longest edge pixel count of 1000 equals 0.15 millimeters. 0.15 as max res gives 1 to 1 pixel to mesh quad ratio. Surfaces with less detail may benefit from pixel averaging. The calculation result can be applied as a factor i.e. in the case of 0.15 mm, 0.30 mm, or 0.60 mm might also be worth consideration. If less detail is present, or smooth surfaces are required, using a multiple of the result can be helpful. Spike filter and anti-spike filter settings will also vary from image to image. These settings address isolated pixels in the image to reduce spikes in 3D print output. Compute alpha channel is deactivated and invert output is made active. Results are recalculated automatically. When processing completes, the ASTL becomes available to save mesh output. Image to STL has no 3D viewing mode. So results are inspected in mesh lab. When setup is in place, it's fast and easy to change source images. A suitable max res value is calculated to meet new job requirements. In this case, results were best. With max res value of 0.26 mm, the new max res value is applied, and the new surface is calculated. Results are quickly saved. And loaded in mesh lab for inspection. Image to STL control and mesh subdivision. Allows user specified correspondence between source image content. 
and the resulting detail in mesh output. Many Lito frames start out as photographs. Image to STL setup is much the same. Max res value is calculated and applied. Lito frames are intended to be translucent with varying depth with reducing source image shading. Typical idle depth will often be 3 to 6 mm to suit cutting into thin plastic sheet or shallow depth 3D printing. Target height value is established at 3 mm with that base value of 0. Calculate alpha channel is activated. To create a level surface around the job. Results are saved. Inspection in mesh lab. Shows that despite the shell of it. Detail from the photograph is well represented in the mesh. A suitable source image is loaded. Target size Y dimension is set to 170mm. Target height dimension is 20mm. Add base is used with value of 3mm. And max red value is set at 0.3mm. Spike and anti-spike filters are active. Calculate alpha channel is active. Invert output is deactivated. Results are calculated. Results are saved. It's clear that image to STL is a versatile tool with much to offer. Combined with in point scale, it can address content generation for many 3D print or CNC tasks.